Welcome to our channel. Today we will talk about the VA Disability Compensation for Flat Feet Secondary to Knee Conditions. If you are a veteran dealing with these issues, you've come to the right place. We'll guide you through the process and ensure you have all the valuable information you need. Let's get started. Did you know that you can connect your flat feet to your service-connected knee condition? You heard right. It is possible. We have helped veterans connecting their flat feet secondary to their knee condition and we can help you too. But first, let's talk a little bit about what is flat feet. Flat feet, also known as fallen arches or pays planus, is a condition where the arches of the feet are flattened, causing the entire sole of the foot to touch the ground when standing. Normally, the foot has an arch formed by tendons, ligaments, and bones, which helps distribute body weight and provide stability during movement. So, how is that possible to link these two conditions? The first thing is to make sure you have a diagnosis of flat feet. Second, you need to be service-connected for a knee condition. And third, you need medical evidence linking both of them. This medical evidence would be a nexus letter or medical opinion, where a medical professional, after a thorough review of your records, will explain how this two conditions are related, establishing the link that you need. Now that you know what you need, it is time to gather your medical evidence. Make sure that you address your medical issues with your medical provider. After your appointments, request a copy of the medical notes, making sure to request the full note and not the summary. And finally, get a nexus letter to help you establishing the link with your service. Now you are ready to fill out your claim. Start by filling out the form in its entirety and submit with all your evidence. If you need assistance, contact a Veterans Service Organization or VSO or talk to a VA accredited attorney. Once you submit your claim, you might need a CNP exam. During this exam, the examiner will fill out the DBQ for foot condition including flat foot, which the rater will use to get the information needed to assign a rating or deny the claim. Make sure to familiarize yourself with the DBQ questions, so you know the information that you need to have at hand to provide to your examiner. When the rater receives the DBQ for your CNP exam and a favorable medical opinion, he or she will use the information to assign a rating under the code 5276. This rating can go from 0% to 50% depending on the severity of the condition and if it affects one foot or both. Getting through the VA claims process can be tough, but if you take the time to learn about it, your chances of success will improve. It's important to remember that you can connect flat feet with a knee condition. If you need help getting a nexus letter for your claim, you can contact www.literalmed.com for support. We hope that this information has been helpful for your case. Thank you for watching. See you in our next video.